of the biggest upgrade to workers' rights in a generation. The Employment Rights Bill will ensure work pays, it will forge a new partnership with business and reset the dreadful industrial relations that have cost our economy and our NHS so much in recent years. We are also preparing for the International Investment Summit next week, bringing hundreds of global CEOs to the UK and unlocking billions of pounds in investment. Mr Speaker, this morning I had meetings with ministerial colleagues and others. In addition to my duties in this House, I shall have further such meetings later today. Gaga Mahindra. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The commitment of £400 million in funding for a new hospital at Watford General was one of the many brilliant things of the previous Conservative government. Yeah. And my good friend, the former member of Parliament for uh, Watford, Dean Russell, did. And would have been life changing as well as life saving so, for so many of my constituents. Why is the Prime Minister cancelling this funding commitment and spending billions of pounds giving pay rises to train drivers yeah. instead? Yeah. Because the promise of 40 new hospitals didn't involve 40, didn't involve hospitals, they weren't new and they weren't funded. Yeah. 